Hi, my name is Ben Philpot. Rowers call me Philly. I'm the president of the rowing club. And I've been doing this for five years. My name is Tom Edwards, and I'm the recruiter for the Sonoma State rowing team. And currently, we are recruiting for all positions for the spring season. Waking up early could be rough. It's definitely not the easiest part of being on the team. I love being out on the water early in the morning because uh, you get to see the sunrise. It's just gorgeous, uh, seeing all the birds and um, you just feel really at peace and coming back to school and you feel like you've, you've done more in the morning than most people do all day. And it's, it's pretty early, but it definitely, you get used to it and it'll give you structure to your day. This being my first year with Sonoma State, I've learned a lot, but something that I have really come to notice with this team is their camaraderie and their dedication. Uh, a lot of teams can come out and do the workouts, but they have a passion and they have a heart and they have love for this sport. And that's what really drives me every single day to come to practice and give my all for the team. I'm extremely proud of them and I'm lucky to be their head coach. I've been with rowing for three years now because I love the team environment. I've just I've grown to really love uh, racing and the competitiveness that rowing has. I've now recruited my sister to be on the team and she really enjoys it also. It's just an instant gratification of kind of putting your oar in the water and just feeling the boat move. It's almost kind of like walking for the first time maybe when you're a kid. It kind of brings you that excitement. You really improve a whole lot and that's that's kind of what brought me back the whole first year is I mean your skill just gets better and better and better and you get so much faster. There's so much improvement that I mean there's no way that you can't enjoy doing it. All right, what's kept me going in the sport for seven years strong uh, is pretty much the teamwork. I definitely couldn't wake up at this early in the morning, five o'clock in the morning for myself, but my teammates, knowing that they're gonna be there and that they're gonna you know, work to making the boats go faster has definitely kept me around this sport for so long. It's a, probably the highest team-oriented sport you know, there is out there. Um, so you get really close with your teammates. They kind of become like your first, if not your second family. Um, my best friends are on the team. All of my best friends are on the rowing team. They're all people that um, share the same interests as me, and we get along great. It made everything fun in college. I'm a part of the lightweight team here at Sonoma State. Uh, we did pretty well my freshman year. We, uh, um, we won Weiras, which is kind of like our regionals. We ended up taking second at nationals last year, which is great. And the greatest thing about that was that we were sophomores and beating all these other boats with seniors in them. All season, we were very successful. We made improvements, leaps and bounds. Competing with a lot of really prestigious schools represented Sonoma State in a positive way. We've had our novice women this year even take down a Stanford boat last race and we've had a pretty positive fall season. We're just looking to carry on that progress into the spring and get some more people because spring is, is, is the most important time. Coming into the spring season, we hope to continue making progress, adding speed in our boats, coming up on those big universities and show them what Sonoma State is all about. Anyone who is willing to come out, work hard, have fun, get in shape, uh, get some time on the water, and also do some traveling. Most people end up loving it. I had never even heard of rowing, and here I am loving it. Rowing really is an amazing sport. It's definitely worth your time to come out. I mean, don't just be an athlete in the gym. Don't just work out every day for nothing. Like, put it to some use. Like, go up against some, some strong people. If you wanted to come check it out, we practice on the Petaluma River, which actually runs underneath the 101. On your way to San Francisco, there's the Sheraton. We're looking forward to taking this season pretty strong. Like with the spring season coming up, and we're hoping to take a first place at nationals coming up real soon here. So stay tuned.